video because I don't want to ruin the whole video with this video if that makes sense but yeah anyway let's get into it hey guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be doing an updated skincare and makeup routine i feel like a couple of makeup routines but now i'm going to film a skincare one as well because i ordered 104 pounds worth of new skincare stuff so i thought why not do a video and all that because yeah i just think it'll be like fun i love seeing other people's skincare routines and stuff so i thought i'd film one for you guys i will put a haul out so you would have the haul will be out before this video because i don't want to ruin the whole video with this video if that makes sense but yeah anyway let's get into it firstly i'm gonna put this up and ignore the noises outside there's loads of building work going on which is really annoying because it's really loud for the camera but yeah we're just gonna have to deal with it so now my hair is at my face i'm going to show you what i'm going to be using so what i'm going to be using is the glow recipe blueberry bounce gentle cleanser i love this like it's so good it's like so cute so i, I got the mini one because i don't want to pay 30 pounds because i've obviously never used it so got a small one so i can like test it out but yeah it's like that super cute absolutely love it definitely worth the hype I like the packaging so cute but yeah i'm gonna go wash my face i will be right back now my face is all washed it actually feels like so just smooth i love it now i'm going to be using whatever skincare bits which i also got i got the glow recipe fruit babies and they're so cute they had the best sellers on there as well but i wanted to get these ones just because i wanted the dew drops as well and i don't want to have them separate but yeah i definitely recommend getting minis if you're a first time buyer because they're small but they're not actually as small as i thought they'd be like they're such a good size and like a perfect if you've like never used it before so you like can test out which ones you like and stuff so i definitely recommend first i'm going to be using the toner this is the watermelon glow pore tight toner which i literally have seen all over tiktok i'm going to move my camera angle there we go but yeah so i just put i put way too much on there but anyway i rub it in it smells like so good i love it now that's all i've done i'm now going to be using the dew drops these are so tiny they're so cute but there's actually quite a lot of product in for such a small size and like that's literally all you need so it's gonna last ages and this smells literally delicious it smells just like watermelon like watermelon sweets it smells like them it smells so nice and it's just so cute and it really gives my skin like a glow next i'm going to be using the strawberry smooth silicic silas silas i don't know this serum and this literally smells like i don't know how to describe it like strawberry it smells just like strawberry body wash from like body shop it's so good i love it all of these smell really nice the only one i would say smells bad is the avocado one and that is just probably because i hate avocado now i'm going to be using the plum plump hyaluronic cream it's so tiny but smells amazing and like literally that's like all you need for your whole face because then it spreads really well like at least you need a tiny little drop and then that will get around my whole face it's just i love it so much because i've always wanted glue recipe but i don't really want to spend 40 pounds per product so i got minis and i'm definitely going to be patching the big ones now i'm going to be using this which is the watermelon pink moisturizer i got it in the smaller size which is still pretty big and I literally just have one drop, just that much, and then put it all over my face. All the watermelon stuff it smells so good. I, before I do my makeup, I always add the glossy primer moisturizer to obviously prime my face. I've not really, all oh, that went everywhere. I've not got much left of this, and I literally only bought this in January 
when I went up to London and I got it in Grossia and it's nearly run out but I did have another one as well so I've used like two since January which is a lot I think but I'm definitely going to re be repurch repurchasing because it's just so good I love it I love all glossy products really that's all my skin prepped I'm now going to be showing you what I do for my makeup I'm not going to do much today because I'm not really doing much so I don't really like just don't really need much but I'm gonna make a bag so basically I'm just gonna do like a clean girl I guess like basic not much makeup like a no makeup makeup look the first thing I always do when I do my makeup is I always start with my eyebrows I literally just use a clear mascara and brush them up I'm looking over here because I got my mirror I feel like eyebrows can literally like complete your look like I feel like they're such an important part of getting ready and like you have to have nice looking eyebrows else your makeup look just isn't going to be working and then what I do is I just use this just to brush through my lashes just to like brush them up a little bit now I've brushed through with a clear mascara I'm going to be using my lash curler this is the dual one I literally love it so much now that's my lashes curled it actually my natural lashes actually look quite nice like they've got no mascara on, obviously apart from clear mascara and curled, but yeah. So next I use the Revolution Concealer. It's supposed to be a dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury Contour, but it's literally ran out. Like barely any comes out. So I definitely need to be getting a new one. Now I'm just gonna blend this in with a beauty blender. And it actually blends so nicely. Now that's all blended in, I'm going to use this, which is the Primark cream blush which has nearly run out but my Primark never has it in stock so I don't know when I'm going to get another one but I might get the Revolution one even though it's £4 more but that's fine but like literally nearly run out then I use oh a different beauty blender to blend that in I use a different one to my contour so then my contour one doesn't have glitter all over it because I don't really want glitter all over my face yeah i just blend that in it blends so nicely and it leaves just like a really nice pink glow which is lovely then i always use this which is just a powder blush from boots i just literally put a tiny bit on my nose and just there just to give it more pink because this one's more like glittery pink this one just gives it a bit more color i just use the same beauty blender to blend that in just so my cheek isn't completely just a line of pink now that it's done i'm going to be doing my lashes i just use these two i use telescopic and sky high and they are literally the best mascaras ever especially telescopic it's my favorite like it lengthens my lashes so much i love it but i will do this off camera because my mascara literally takes me eight now my mascara is all done i'm going to be using the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil as, oh my god, a highlighter, so I just put a bit on the end of my nose and then back, oh, up there and then just blend it in and then I've also put a little bit in the corners of my eyes and then lastly I'm going to put some Dior Lip Oil on just because it's literally the best thing ever, it makes my lips look so hydrated i love it it's literally my really basic skincare makeup routine which i absolutely love and it just looks so cute but yeah i hope you've enjoyed this video if you have make sure to give this video a big thumbs up subscribe down below and hit the notifications bell so you don't miss any more of my videos just like this one thanks for watching love you bye